Members of a Collin County community gathered tonight to honor a man who was a coach and a mentor to many young athletes. Trey Bodie died after suffering a heart attack at just 39 years old. He coached youth softball, baseball, basketball, football, impacting many, many young lives. And tonight a vigil was held in Salina to honor him. Fox Sports' David Centendry is live with the story. David. Yeah, Heather, the vigil wrapped up just a bit ago. It's been done for maybe about 15 or 20 minutes, but some people are still out here talking and sharing stories. Now, when it started just after 8 p.m., the lights were on, similar to how it looks right now. But about halfway through the vigil, the lights went off as everyone raised their candles into the air. And it was during those moments you could really just feel the emotion amongst the crowd of more than a couple hundred people, everyone with their own stories to share about the coach. A few hours ago, I went to the home of one of his family members. We sat down for a conversation. They say this vigil comes during a time when they need it most. Sports have a way of bringing people together, a distraction from life's challenges. He ate, slept, and breathed yeah. youth sports. In Salina, one coach's commitment to youth sports is bringing the community together when his family needs it most. He coached my son that morning. Trey Body, a 39-year-old youth football, baseball, softball, and basketball coach, coached his last game Saturday. Felt a little bit of yeah. pain in his chest and numbness in his arm. His wife, Tara, says he suffered a heart attack and died. He leaves behind two young children, 10-year-old Titan and 14-year-old Isabel, and his own siblings. You can't explain why he died at 39. During their darkest hour, candlelight reveals love from their community. A vigil Wednesday at the old Bobcat Field in Salina. Such an amazing man. Tara and I are close friends and I wanted something for their family just to be able to remember the great husband he was, the great father he was, and the amazing coach. What does it say with this many people coming out? How much of an impact did he make? Huge, huge. Coach Body's family was surprised when they heard about it. So it just shows what this community is. And overwhelmed with gratitude. And I know he's seeing it and my parents are seeing it and they'd be so proud because I know I am, you know, as his sister. So. You might think with this type of showing, the family has lived in Salina for decades. Well, it's only been five years. They say that's a glowing example of how tight knit and special their community is. We will never be able to thank each and every one of them individually, but all I can say is that I'm grateful that I'm a part of Salina. We did find our home, Salina's home, and I'm so grateful for everybody in this community. Certainly, there were plenty of somber moments throughout the evening, but I would like to point out that plenty of people came up to us and they expressed gratitude that we were out here. And the reason it's so important to point that out is because they say it is very important to share this coach's story.